passionate. I work hard to win it, pop it in on accident. Yeah, I'm always on go, better watch your watch. Hello guys, so welcome back to the channel. Welcome to the channel if you're new here. Okay, I'm Daquana plus size hauls i got some diys actually coming up for this like whole studio area over here which i'm really excited about um so if you're interested in that type of stuff stay tuned i do lifestyle content vlogging real life talks and things of that nature now as far as vlogs i'm trying to be more consistent okay so bear with me because i just moved if you don't know and this is a part of trying to get things together so today i am bringing you an ace off try on haul um i try on basically everything from ace off i get is a 3x unless it's one size fits all or um well most or if it's a what is it called like a stretchy top or something i can do a 2x or like a bandeau like this a 2x or something like that so other than that <laughs> most of the time i'm getting a 3x from ace off so i'm super excited i feel really good i feel like i look really good i'm happy that you guys bear with me week after week after week okay so a little bit of housekeeping of course i have an ace off code which is d dash white 25 it'll pop up somewhere i don't know somewhere where you guys can actually see it so maybe down here in this little bit of white space but um yes i have a coupon code d white 25 where you can save on your order i did see comments that i meant to address and we'll address it with the housekeeping in just a second here so uh let's go ahead i want to show you guys the pictures i just took just now in this area and it's basically my vision has come to fruition into fruition basically what i wanted it's it's exceeded my expectations okay so um yeah let me sit this down on a boot <laughs> so yeah um housekeeping let's do a mental health check-in mentally i feel really really good i do feel like i'm getting back on track i feel like i've been accomplishing more um and trying to get my schedule kind of together now my nights have still been late nights because i've like my sleep pattern is not where i want it to be but um i still feel like i am getting better with that so i do have something huge that i've been working on and super excited to bring you guys that and i cannot wait to share it so i've been you know kind of worried about that we're well, not worried but excited about that so you know kind of pacing myself um as the days go on so mentally again i am doing well i feel really well i'm trying to get back into my morning routine i want to drink tea <laughs> i want to work out so i'm trying to slowly maneuver back in there so once i'm there i think i'll feel like maybe 100 percent. but right now i'm at about a 90 okay so i'm okay um i don't have a random question yet i'll leave it down below or i'll put it on the screen once i think of it throughout this try on haul um, I do have a bunch of hauls that I'm filming today. So you will see this set up a couple of times. Um, well, most of the time now because I really love it so much. But I have some hauls like over here spread out, over there on the couch spread out, hanging up. So I'm really excited to film those as well. Um, let me think, let me think. Housekeeping. Oh, this backdrop, this studio backdrop um, is basically... As you can see, I have the mirror, the little table, the um, vase here with the pompous grass, and I have a faux tree and the teddy blake. And, you know, like, you know, it's just something that's different and cute, and I can use it in a photo backdrop, which you'll see me put on the screen right about now. So I did film that, so I will post that once I edit it and things like that. Um, I think that's all the housekeeping no also somebody mentioned the price so the reason why i continually work with asop every single week is because they're a consistent company i actually love their clothes most of the time when i'm wearing clothes it is asop so you know i do understand that some things are a little bit pricier and most of the times if i notice it off the bat i'll be like yo that's a bit much for that item like you know so i'm really happy that they do give me the code d white 25 because it does save you on your order so um yeah keep that in mind and 
I know prices fluctuate and depending on what it is, sometimes you can find something that's about $10. Sometimes things are going to be $90 to $100. But um, I try to do a range of things to kind of fit budgets. The last thing for housekeeping I wanted to mention is the closet sale. So I know people are like, I've been stalking your thing, refreshing your page. When are you posting certain things? I was posting 10 things every day or every other day until I was done posting. Um, weekly, I think I'm going to just start doing uh, adding things up there every two weeks or so so that I don't build it all up and then it's a not a hassle but it's a lot of time and it's very time consuming to sift through 200 to 300 items um, and then try to take pic find the pictures for them and all of that. So I have been adding things like 10 to 15 items at a time every other day or so. Um, so it gives you all a chance to kind of sift through and see what you want and it gives everybody, you know, it kind of falls on different pay periods and things like that. So I've just been trying to look out and not overwhelm myself and overwhelm you all and I don't want um, everyone to miss out on certain things. So that's why I've been slowly, gradually adding things on there. So, um, yeah, random question for this week. Are you still a fan of peplum or are you peplumed out? Did the people peplum you out? Did the plus size manufacturers peplum you out? Me personally, I am still a fan of peplum. So let's go ahead and hop into this haul because this intro was a little long so I do apologize for that. Thank you ASOP for sponsoring this video. Thank you for sponsoring my brand I Wanna Be where I offer courses, merch, and planners. On my head I am wearing um, the Thrifty Slay unit and this is the Deep Wave unit here. So yes, let's go ahead and hop in. So this first thing I'll talk about is actually this tube top here. Um, it is so comfortable. But do you guys get a little bit anxious when you're like, where is the tag? I'm so used to the ASOF tag. It's black and pink or black and peach. And I'm used to seeing it. So I know, you know, how to put things on and where to put them. But sometimes when I don't see it, I kind of get nervous. Like, which way do I wear it? Even though I know it's a bandeau. Sometimes they be built a little differently. So this one is ribbed as in the texture. And then it's really, really stretchy and comfort. Comfort? Like... Well, I'm about to say comforting. It doesn't comfort me, but it's comfortable, okay? So it is comfortable. Um, I do feel like it holds my girls up a little better than other bandos that I do have. This one feels a little more supportive. So I do like this one here. I'll come up close so you guys can see the texture here. So really, really nice. It, it feels really good on too. And then it has really nice coverage as well. So then I paired it. I'll just show you the coverage of it before I move on to the next thing. But this is what that looks like. Is my skirt on right? Okay. So then I paired it, and I can do this now because I waxed my underarms. But I paired it with this skirt here. And if they're giving me peplum like this, I am still a fan. Okay. <laughs> like I really do love this skirt. I'm definitely keeping this. I will wear this outfit just like this with a silver heel, nude heel, pop of color, a clear heel. You can do so much with such a basic, elegant outfit um, that's still trendy. So again, are you peplumed out or no? But I really love this. I love the feature here that has the little slit and then, um, well, the ruffle and then the little slit as well. I like that they put the slit on the side and not in the back because you guys know I am not a fan of back slits, okay? And sometimes not even front slits. So this is what it looks like back here. And the reason that I still like peplum before we wrap this outfit up is because peplum, the skirts are usually like a scuba thick material. And I know some people are scuba material out, but the really thick stretch material that's kind of firm, it feels like, um, foam core or like a foamy material is what it feels like so I know some people were like we're tired of that material stop giving it to us but I like it because um as far as underneath you don't really have to do too much I can do a black spandex short and be okay I can do a full coverage nude panty and be okay so that's why I really like this style and I love this material but they did overdo it with peplum with scuba with so many things so let's go ahead and hop into the next outfit 
or the next bottom rather I feel like I wanted to mention something, but I kind of forgot. But let's go ahead and hop into this skirt here. So this is such a beautiful skirt. I love the color. I love how it fits and flows. Um, I like how it has this drawstring here and how this material is like a chiffon overlay. So I've been kind of into this like, you know, I don't, I wouldn't call this, I guess boho chic, but the color is not giving boho, but the vibe is, but I've been into skirts like this and tying them up and, you know, making them all cute and stuff. Um, I did a video about that last week at my, on my ASOP haul. I showed you guys how I tie it up, but, um, yeah, me and Jan, we do this thing every Tuesday. We didn't do it this Tuesday, but every Tuesday we were trying to kind of try new restaurants, go find plant shop, well, go plant shopping to find plants or pots, um, and just little plant knickknacks. So, yeah, we've been kind of doing that thing and hasn't always been consistent on a Tuesday. It's like whatever day we're like, all right, let's go do it. But trying again, again, rather get into some balance and scheduling okay but yeah um this has been the vibe for that whole thing this color here is gorgeous it reminds me of the jade pants that i tried on last week i promise you guys that is probably one of my favorite trousers from asof okay um if you're wondering i am 5'4 so this is where the front falls on me so yes i do keep my measurements on my website if you click the style tab click on closet sale you'll see my measurements for the most part they're accurate um i may have to update one or two things so you can see that this skirt does lift up in the back so i'm not really happy about that there but it is okay um because most of the time if i'm wearing a flowy skirt like this like i said i would just do my little hair tie here and do something like this anyway so you can't really tell that it's like super low in the front and kind of high in the back but yeah, that is this skirt here. It does have this drawstring. Um, this is like an overlay of material because it does have this underlay right here. Um, the actual material doesn't really have stretch the top portion of it, but the underlay does. And then you do have stretch in the waistband. So that is this skirt here. Let's rewind this back a little bit. Um, it's an honor, you know, to be able to bring you guys this content every single week. It's an honor to be able to do something that I love and, you know, to, I love the ups and downs of everything. I love learning and growing throughout this whole process. I want to thank you all for not only, you know, because if it wasn't for you, I wouldn't be here, but not only that for witnessing my growth for um you know people who come back every single week or every other week once a month whatever the case is and constantly show support show love i still have people who sign up for members of my channel and i still have giveaways that i have to do for that and packages that i have to send out for that i have not forgotten about you guys but just looking at the things around me and looking at my growth i have like no one to thank outside of you all a higher power you know the love the support and um i'm just thankful again to be able to come and bring you these things this content all of this my businesses and all of that every single week y'all so um what made me think about that is looking around like the studio lights i can literally film at any time of day not having to worry about trying to catch daylight and all of that looking at the monitor which is now something i can see in looking at the mirrors every angle i'm able to see okay you know how something fits i used to bring you guys stuff from the comfort of my parents living room or a bedroom that i was sharing with my sister and this was just in 2015 2016 so Thank you all, okay? So let's not get too emotional. <laughs> let's go ahead and hop into these trousers here. So I absolutely love these. I love that they have pockets. Um, I tried these on in the jade color last week. I love that color, Asaf. I love this color as well. <laughs> but um, the colors y'all been bringing me, really, really nice. So I think they call this like a rust color. And when the screen kind of dims down like this, this is the true color of the pant okay so these are really comfortable like i said brunch church class uh teaching corporate whatever you do just want to be sexy and go out lunch date whatever these pants are everything you don't always feel like wearing a dress a skirt 
uh, sometimes you just want something like this okay and even like vacation vibes bando sandal wide leg trouser this is everything and i love 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 this color it does come with the belt as i mentioned before the only thing i was hoping for was a middle loop here to kind of bring the belt down a little bit because or else it would just kind of slide up so that was the only thing that i kind of wanted from these pants but i promise you they have black i think they have nude jade this color and i think one other color i love these and if you don't get anything else from asof get these trousers are we are we done being emotional for today <laughs> are we done so um this is something really quick that i wanted to show you all on the website you see the model wearing it with um a matching top so i was sent this skirt actually last week i didn't show you guys um but i'm showing you this week uh, it's just a mini skirt okay it is mini it's like a black white grayish um almost like an abstract ombre print which is really really cute so as you can see it's mini and it's crazy how a simple white bandeau that's why i say this is a staple okay if you want me to do a video with like basics and necessities and staples you should have in your closet comment down below but this right here is a staple whether it is a strapped tank or cami or just a crop whatever or even just a bodysuit a white top is needed um i love this one here and i honestly see myself wearing it more often and going to buy every other color they might have maybe one other color but buying multiple white ones because i love a good white bando um you can put a jean jacket over it a duster whatever but you can always pair it with something like this and if you're not comfortable wearing a mini skirt because you know booty cheeks whatever thighs you don't want hanging out you can always put something long like a black sheer duster over top so yeah this top right here has proven to be effective in like four outfits here so far or maybe five but as you can see in the back this is a little short so I would definitely do like a chiffon white or black duster on top because um it's just a little short on me okay but it is like a stretch material it feels double layered so it's like sheer and then you have this black spandex underneath um i really like that about this so um i'm trying to think if i want to keep it around um again i'm not supposed to keep everything and like that last haul i did last week from asaw i basically asaw y'all gotta chill with the designs but y'all got me wanting to keep everything but i basically kept like everything from the last haul maybe except one outfit and i'm supposed to be kind of cleaning out my closet and i'm just adding to it but yeah this is a cute skirt to have um i would say i'm definitely getting vacation vibes just a summer fit vibe so let me stand here so you guys can get the details when i tell you i absolutely love this corner and i can't wait to show you guys that video because it was a brilliant idea if i do say so myself i never even knew that they made corner curtain rods like what but um this is the detail um if you have been watching my ace off hauls week after week i would say about a month ago i actually hauled a top was it this color i want to say it was this color but um it was this style as far as the top and then it was just like a long um blouse so um it seems like you know they recycled the idea into a dress form or maybe they took the dress and made it a top who knows but i do love this so um you can get away with um even though it's sheer and stuff here you can get away with like a skin tone nude uh strapless bra if you're not comfortable wearing your girls like this so yes um then you have the rest of the dress which is basically flowy as you can see you can also do a whole like little knot here um it does have these two side slits which i'm standing on one but if you wanted to do something like a knot in the front um you can do that as well or if you wanted to take the front and tie it to the back and kind of swing it around i'm stepping on it <laughs> you can do that as well and make it kind of shorter um personally i would probably leave it long I don't really like you know the vibe of this because i feel like it's a lot of material just sitting there so i would probably just leave it long or do like that little oh uh oh yeah about the, uh, sneak peek but you can do something like a little knot here if you want to make it more sexy um i'll probably do something like that or just 
let it hang like this but um as far as underneath you want to be mindful because it is a lightweight material so you might want to wear some spandex shorts or something underneath if you're like me and you like freedom and not being um constricted by shapewear and courses and things like that which i don't mind if that's what you choose to do <laughs> but me personally i like to be free when i'm out and about i gotta get in and out the car okay i gotta go in stores walk around sit on couch whatever i'm doing i want to be comfortable so as far as constriction i'll wear a spank from time to time but y'all some good old granny panties under here or a nice just regular biker short or spandex short will work just fine i don't think you need any shapewear all right so i have some it's crazy because i really like my a stuff haul okay but dang do i really gotta like everything so i know some people are on edge about stripes you don't want to look wider don't want to look shorter taller whatever or i don't even know some people may not want to look smaller you know um but what i've heard most of the time growing up was these horizontal stripes are gonna make you look wider and you don't want to look wider and i'm like honey if i'm wide i'm wide and not a piece of clothing is gonna take that away from me i'ma just be wide okay stop playing with me <laughs> but no for real for real um i think this is really cute actually this kind of does give you uh more width and the way the stripes go they're like not straight across they're like a you know you know a little illusion <laughs> i don't know but they actually do kind of curve down into this material here so i know some people be like oh i wish i had more hips or whatever if you're looking for a dress that's gonna give you some hips this one right here is gonna do that okay and i like the way it is i like the way the top is like dainty and you know just simple and then the, you have this extra material here that kind of flares it out a little bit so again i'm not scared of looking wider okay i actually think this is cute and very chill if you don't want it to be so uniform and just up and down you can definitely i'm actually getting left and right not even up and down but you can definitely take it and do a cute knot but i actually think it works like this you can also take a nice cognac or just like a medium brown belt and put it on that would look really cute with this with a cognac sandal and a cognac hat or maybe no hat you know i've just been wanting to do hats lately but yeah i think this is actually a vibe it's really really comfortable as well you don't really have to worry about putting on a bra because it's so distracting so this is what the back looks like okay and i gotta stop i always take some of my hair and put it like over here and then the back just be looking crazy but it's okay but that is this dress here it's really comfortable it's lightweight it's breathable um it does have stretch in the actual material and most of the time um i do have to take the straps and do like a knot and i was talking about this with the amazing sarah um last week uh we were talking about how we have to always knot our tanks and stuff because the strings are too long but this one is actually fine and i think it sits really nicely on and i love blue on me as well let's get an out range it's over here okay so how pretty is this y'all i i'm a fan of stripes and although this is just like line work going all types of ways it's giving stripes and you'll see how much i love stripes really really soon but i really do love a nice stripe and this pattern is giving the colors are given it's definitely giving summertime fine vacation hot girl summer you already know we outside is what i'm getting with this here it has this really pretty sexy elegant side slit um it's really nicely done now let me tell you the straps of this are actually controlled by a string in the back which is like another detail which you'll see when i turn around i think the length is really nice i love that they do they're doing um side slits instead of like middle and back center slits i do not i cannot i will not but i think the side slit is definitely more 
doable for me i don't feel like i'm gonna have a cooch slip or a booty slip you know whatever the case may be so let's show you this the back here so it does have like that um uh what do you want to call it lace up detailing back there and basically if you untie it you can control how much more neckline you'll get so i'll do that for you so let me untie it back here okay and then if i turn around here i can actually kind of make it come a little lower so i thought that was a really cool feature and then you can turn back around i'm not sure if i'll be able to do it but you can turn back around and just tie it back so you can definitely customize this to your liking if i can get it i'm probably looking at my faces in the mirror like girl what <laughs> but here we go i made a bow but you can definitely tailor it to your body and i really like that and it's more comfortable this way because it's not pulling on my shoulders so that is this dress here and when you do that you can also have more room to pull it down so so yes this is beautiful definitely keeping this and i definitely want to wear it when i go to the beach with my girlfriend all righty because i'm like where was mustard this whole summer like i have a few things but not enough so don't mind my girls they're doing their thing that they do okay but for the most part of this haul i didn't need a bra but i should have pulled one out for this one here but it's okay you get the vibes um you know a bra make it look a little bit better because your girls be sitting higher okay but um yeah i love this how many times are you gonna say that for every freaking thing in the haul basically but i like the color it's mustard but it's like a muted mustard um you do have this drawstring which is not functional here but it does cinch in at the waist um the drawstring i guess is just for shits and giggles <laughs> no but for i think it's for you know looks and uh, it gives it like a more casual sporty ish feel but then it's wide leg so it's not really sporty so this is a lightweight um material really really stretchy um i want to thank them because with the neckline i did not struggle <laughs> trying to get into it because it does tie in the back um this material is lightweight very very lightweight but you can tie it in the back i just tied it once i didn't even do a bow um but yeah because of that i was able to step in here with ease now this is long on me so this is the length that we're getting boo's making a lopsided and whatnot but the length is really really nice now y'all know if i don't like it you can of course hem it um but me personally if i don't like it i would definitely cut off a little bit stretch it a little bit like i do my t-shirts and stuff um and make it work for me without having to sew it and all that good stuff because anybody got time for that but um yeah it's really comfortable it's really breathable you have pockets here i think you can definitely go dressing with this or kind of chill you know not doing too much with it as well so i have two more jumpsuits and i'm sad to see y'all go because this was a bomb haul all right but y'all come on man that's me rolling my eyes because i love this so much so um this is definitely giving vacation. Uh, I don't know how I feel about this print kind of rolling up because it gives the demarcation. But I mean, look, whatever body I got is whatever body's going to be in these outfits. And that is what it is. But no, I think this is actually super gorgeous. And even though it's white and different and the cut is like insanely crazy, but good at the same time, I still think it's very, very effective. And I also still think it's still flattering as the girlies say um but i still think it's not just you know tacky looking cheap looking or anything like that because this could have easily been something where it was like girl i am not wearing that but this is actually so freaking pretty i know y'all heard this throughout this whole haul but y'all literally like look at your girl in the background just making me like yo vacation me vacation me okay but um i like that it's long sleeve i like that the pants are long very very long i'll show you the length when i back up again but very very long 
um, because you're still kind of open here. So it's like, oh, I don't know. But then it's like, but I'm really, really covered. And the only thing that's really out is a triangle here. And then it's off shoulder. So it definitely works. Um, then you have the back. It is a lightweight stretch material. So um, this is what it's looking like back there. I'm kind of stepping on the pants. So I would definitely have to um, trim these down because they're really, really long as you can see so i have some room left in the leg a lot of room left hanging in the leg area so that's the only thing for this is definitely tall girl friendly all right um because it is dragging on your girl but this is so fire all right so we are down to the last piece which is a jumpsuit i didn't do sets today y'all I didn't do any sets. Aren't y'all proud of me? Even though I love a good set. I did do a half of a set with the mini skirt. But um, they're so separately. The pieces are so separately for that one. So um, I feel like. Let's take the idea of this. Um, well I was about to say romper. <laughs> jumpsuit here right. And then put it into the outfit. With the last thing. Then you'll see what I'm talking about. Because if that was just a print. Skinny leg white jumpsuit that was built or just made like this i probably wouldn't like it because something like this that's fitted i would want it to be solid so i like that they did a flare long dramatic leg and it was tie up here um in the long sleeve make it a little more covered because if it was this i would want like again solid colors so this is like a brick um i call it like a berry brick color it's really really pretty in person it's given more of a peachy orange dark tone um, than a pinky purple undertone so um, although it is fitted it is revealing it's a solid color so I really like it so you have the scrunch effect on both legs and then you do have erosion that is functional in this area here so I'll go ahead and come up and show you that but before then this is the back here so it is really like open and a little revealing and tight and stuff. Um, so this is something I would consider more sexy, but the other one is like a more sexy classy. So coming up, you can see, you can control this a little, pull this up and then decide kind of where you want it to fall. I am kind of nervous about the side there because I don't want too much kind of showing, but yeah. Then you can take it and tie it. So let me know down below, are you peplumed out or do you still like peplum? And then also keep in mind, I do have a coupon code for ASOF, which is D-White25. Also, so are you peplumed out or do you still love it? And lastly, comment what your favorite thing from this haul was. And I know it's going to be hard for you to choose because it's really hard for me to choose as well. So thank you ASOP again for sponsoring this video. Guys, keep in mind I still have more moving vlogs coming. I have my lock, my hair locking journey start, all of that coming. Um, I have a big announcement coming. I have some more clothing hauls coming and then I have some little tech review that I want to do. Um, a couple of tech reviews that I want to do actually and yeah so we have content constantly being made and rolled out and I'm also going to be doing more content with the plant room and um, packing orders and things like that over on my Instagram channel and possibly TikTok as well. So thank you guys so much for joining. Comment if you still like peplum or no and comment your favorite piece from this haul and also use that coupon code D-White25.